Good morning, Brookwood Beavers. This is Nora and Sarah reporting live from the Brookwood Broadcasting Center. Today is Tuesday, October 30th, 2018. The weather for today is cold in the morning and then hotter in the afternoon in a high of 69, but it was pretty nice this morning, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that working out to the bus stop or getting in your car. Um, Today's lunch is chicken nuggets, country fried steak, PBJ sandwich with cheese and crackers, yogurt with cheese stick and crackers, served with mashed potatoes and country gravy, fresh baby carrots, romaine lettuce, fresh broccoli, fresh fruit, and rosy applesauce. And we do not have any birthdays today, so that will be saved for tomorrow though. I know this is pretty crazy, but there are two kids in Brookwood. I didn't check the names, but there are two kids in Brookwood that have birthdays on Halloween. So that's pretty fun, you know, get a lot of candy on your birthday, including a birthday cake, maybe. Um, anyways, and now, now for, for Mr. Mr. Frick. All right. Good morning, everybody. Oh. So last night we had a fun night at the Harlem Wizards game. Lots of Brookwood kids out there. Um, root me on. And I think you guys would all agree it was a fun time. If you, even if you were waiting for me to, to dunk, that which did not happen, uh, it was still fun. Our very own Bo here from Brookwood got a chance to go out and get some free items from the Harlem Wizards. And they did a lot of fun stuff with the crowd, lots of dancing, lots of funny stuff. So overall, it was a really fun night. And it went to a great cause to help out the Shining Mission South Lady Raider basketball team to raise some funds for them. So uh, good time had by all. Um, speaking of good times, today at 110 we get to have our Beaver Lodges again. So you get to meet with all of your friends in your Beaver Lodge this afternoon. Uh, just a reminder that my fifth and sixth graders, you'll kind of help get the first and kindergartners, uh, bring them to the locations. And we've got a little uh, fall Halloween pumpkin activity for you guys to work on together as a group. But also you're going to get to work on finish up some of your big posters that you guys started last time. So lots of things going on today during Beaver Lodge. Um, just wanting my fourth, fifth, and sixth graders to kind of take those leadership roles, help out the younger kids with some of those situations. I know you guys will do a great job with that. Um, and I think that's all I've got for you today. I think uh, Nora and Sarah can kind of finish up the rest of the announcements, tell you what's going on tomorrow, and also if you got some Blue Jump Thursday, you can talk about that. Yeah. Do you want to say anything about uh, costumes with Halloween? Oh, for Halloween, um, just a reminder, tomorrow when you guys come to school, you'll already be dressed, ready to go. So we'll start the parade around 8.30. Looks like the weather should be decent, we'll see. Uh, we'll probably, for the most part, parade inside the building. Um, if it's nice like today, we'll probably ha let you guys go outside, walk around the back parking lot and go in. Go out by the door by Mrs. Lake's room, go around and then come back in by the door by Mr. Mosier's room, and then back down that hallway. But um, Afterwards, we'll have the parties. We should be done around 9.45 or 10 o'clock. Uh, if you've got costumes that you can just kind of wear the rest of the day, that's fine. But for like the big mask and the big things, like I know there's a Rubik's Cube out there, uh, you'll just have a chance to take those off. So just make sure if you need to change of clothes or anything like that, you bring that with you tomorrow. Um, but I know the teachers have a lot of fun stuff planned for you guys tomorrow after Halloween as well. So I think that covers it, right? Yep. Okay, back to Norton. So we so. have our no, you're fine. Sorry, um, we have our own Colette Davis with uh, stage crew today. Or well, I guess we don't really have stage crew, but she's here. So oh, and yeah, a reminder, just here. remind them about Fifth and Sister Choir today. Oh yeah, here's Colette. Hi. Okay, <laughs> so we have Fifth and Sixth Grade Choir today from 8.45 to 10.45. So there's not the whole day, but make sure that when you get back, you're respectful of everybody other, uh, blah, blah, blah. going crazy today. You are respectful for all your other classmates' time. Um, uh, and we have a Beaver Lodge at 1.10 today. So don't lose your groups. Yeah, don't lose your groups. Um, we have, okay, so for Timber Ridge, Timber Ridge is the day after Halloween, and I know I said something yesterday, but I am assuming like half of the grade is probably going to be tired from sixth grade from Halloween the night before, so make sure you're getting a good breakfast, and um, make sure you are turning in your forms, because I'm sorry to say, but if you don't turn in your forms, it's 
you probably won't be able to do a lot of the fun things but yes yeah, so that is exciting that is on thursday the day after halloween and um halloween it uh, yeah. uh yeah so the halloween party starts at 8 30 and so i know mr frick said that but make sure you are bringing a change of clothes if you have a big costume um Today's national days are Candy Corn National Candy Corn Day, National Speak Up Day, and National Publicistic Day. So yeah, yeah, that was those were the national three days. But yes, yeah, so and we have our joke to end all this morning announcements. Okay, Sarah, how do you organize a space party? I don't know. How do you organize a space party? You plan it. <laughs> so, please give your teacher your attention for the Pledge of Allegiance and have a great day.